Welcome back to my channel. Cek, 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 cek. Cek, welcome back to my channel. Cek, cek. Hi everyone. Welcome back to my channel. This is Mike. This is my sister. Cek. This is my sister. Sister go to school. Or she's to go to school. Then who am I? Hi everyone. Assalamualaikum. My name is Alina and welcome back to my channel. This is my brother. My brother. This is my brother. Okay. Earlier in the earlier clip, that's my brother. And for today's video, I'm gonna do a get ready with me plus testing out new products. The products that I'll be testing today is going to be the smart drawing kit from Innisfree, which is actually this is my brother. Which is actually sent to me last month. Thank you for my sister. So I do. Thank you. Which is which is actually sent to me last month. So, but I've already played with this, but I'm just going to review it to you guys as I wear it. So today I'll also be reviewing this Clinique Moisture Search Moisturizer, which I will put on before I put on my makeup. Try out this the Hypercar Volume Express Mascara from Maybelline. Yeah. This is the Brina Beauty Wonderlust collection, which is actually the Raya collection this year, but I didn't get to play with them all yet. And we'll see how all of these items play out together. So by the way, how do you guys like the new lighting? I think I prefer this lighting more than the dimmer lights. And right the way, I'm using this Innisfree um, Lip Sleeping Pack with Canola Honey Lip Treatment Thingy. Because my lips are so chapped. And this is the only thing that won't dry out my lips even more. And we'll try to get in this free. Okay, so by the way, I'm going to have this new series which is called Borat Makeup. Which is going to be a get ready with me while we'll talk about makeup and life and try out things. Which is going to be, inshallah, exciting. Let's try out this Clinique Moisture Search. Ni I beli sendiri, okay? It's about, I nak try. There's so many, um, ramai sangat my friends yang suka this product. But I've never tried it before, and I've bought it three days ago, two to three days ago. And so far, I feel like it leaves my skin nice and hydrated. And by the way, I wash my hands dulu eh, beforehand. Um, and I don't like to wear primer because I feel like the primer is just going to ball up after I put on my makeup, and that doesn't look cute. So that's why I like to put moisturizer before because nowadays my skin is super duper dry. And if you hear me getting sniffles, that is because I'm sick. So I feel like it instantly gives me that healthy glow to my face. And you know, I'm not going this thing on my face, which is fine. We can cover it up. No problem, absolutely no problem at all. So for the smart drawing kit, uh, the vanilla green color corrector for my redness. So let's try. Let's try. And by the way, for my skin, I'm going to use two colors, which is going to be number zero one light beige. This is the lightest shade, and also the number zero three. Natural beige. Again, the green color corrector. And then let's add like a stick stick in the top. It looks like that. And the consistency of this is like kind of like that baby cushion. Ice cool, ice cool. And here. Do do. Kalau kita letak satu muka hijau, kita boleh jadi shrek. And then taking this dense sculpting brush by Real Techniques and stipple it out. Chinito. We're just going to stipple our makeup. See? It looks more. It's a bit bathy in your skin. It looks like skin. That one also. Stipple it out. See? It's not a bit. It's not a See? See, 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 see. Spanish people be looking at my videos. Cakap apa hal? Lagu dah nido cakap yes, yes, yes gitu. So now we're gonna take the shade number zero three natural beige, and then kita akan put this on the top 
here, here, skate, skinny skate, skinny skate, skinny skate. We won't put a lot of the products because, as you guys can see, it's super duper pigmented. Skate that skate, je. Sini pun skate, je. Sini pun malu malu gitu je skate, je. And then you'll see lah how great it is. Like many people thought that I put on layers and layers of foundation on my skin. Well, dah berapa? Dah sebulan lebih dah. I think I've been wearing this one je. And to me, it works super duper well with me. Masa sesuai lah. And this one, to be honest, I pakai sikit je. But then it's because it's super duper pigmented. It seems like I pakai banyak. Taking the same brush. Kita akan tutup. We're just gonna tap this, huh? I feel like I've chosen a very, very light shade love for my skin. Yeah, I should have gone tan now. But that's okay. That's okay. Her nose, we're just gonna grab the product. And then for the top of your forehead also, we're just going to tap, 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 and then blend. I'm just gonna brush it through, get to. So we don't have to put product at places yeah, which I need because it's gonna look. But um, there's a bronze gradient, okay, from your forehead and then down, so that I don't have to put on a bronzer afterwards. Which I like. So this is the full on product on my face. Honestly, I think I could I could have gone a little bit tanner, but um, yeah, it's fine. Okay, I And then for my under eyes, I'm gonna put the lightest shade, which is called Light Beach. To be honest, again. I want to talk about why I stopped filming last year which is gonna be so so I don't know I feel like that experience of mine last year was really dramatic and not dramatic lah I feel like it shouldn't be dramatized I do go I get to dramatize but then like I don't want to be seen as when someone with that is equal to me but um I get it, you know, if someone says that they feel demotivated or they just feel like they are lost the spark in terms of producing content or bukan malas, it's not it's not malas. It's not malas. Trust me, it's not malas. It's just but um you've lost your ilham. Need some not but video. You feel much okay, so what should I have what should I do? It's, um you get me? So, but even last year's, I told lot so 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 many opportunities and also big events that to me would mean a lot right now. But you know, but I know it is what it is, and yeah, I cannot do anything about that now, right? So for contour, I'm taking this shade called Number Zero Three Mocha. So, but I think the darkest shade is because the lightest shade is too too light for me, and yeah. why I feel those things is because when you're not in a happy place of your life, you know, when you feel like, oh, this is going nowhere for me, or when you feel much, um, this is not, I've lost my spark last year, and it's really crazy feeling that way, and I'm still so young, I was only 19, so I feel demotivated, I feel like I don't get enough support that I would need, and I feel like I have no one. Okay, yeah. Talking about, about this contour product, I feel like it's too light. Do much um instead of giving a shadow on my face, it gets muddy. You see? So I'm ta ta nampak sangat yang it is contouring. But yeah, I feel like um back to the story, I feel like I've lost my sense of self. 
dia tak macam how enthusiastic I am and how macam you know you know this kind of a thing I don't feel like I can do that last year it's crazy this is number zero to cherry blossom pink for the blush I know I'm gonna say like it's crazy how it's oh it's too much blah 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 but alhamdulillah I'm so happy that I can get out of that mindset where I feel really really helpless I feel like I'm doing something that isn't going to make myself happy in the long run but I'm glad at the end I chose something that's going to make me happy so gitulah I was happy sangat sangat and there's so many people who notice how you know how I've been senyap how I've been gone even um as of lately pun people are asking like oh you seem happier and to be honest alhamdulillah I am happier and there is no secret to be oh how eh? am I supposed to get rid of this blah 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 because it took me one and a half years actually to just get out of that um, terrible place of mind mindset you know it's, it's I understand when people say oh it's all in your mind but what's in my mind affects my physical and I managed to get through the bad phase of my life hmm. the until bulan nam this year then only I feel like I don't have to wake up with so much anxiety and all um yeah if not like waking up with anxiety until now lah to be honest I still wake up with anxiety I still wake up with anxiety but it's nothing crazy yang buat air so macam why I cannot take this it's fine you know it's um even if it's anxiety these days I feel like it's bearable macam I have supportive friends I have Supportive family member have a partner that understands how I am, that knows how to handle when I'm having this kind of thoughts on my head, which is Alhamdulillah so far. It's great. This is number. This is strobing. This is for highlight. Number zero to peach light. I know that's cute because I already feel like people are really really glowy right now. And trust me, when I use this makeup, I do not, I do not set my makeup. The reason why is because I want to keep that glass, not that how highlighty that is. I want to keep this glass skin kind of a thing, which I really like. So yeah. I, uh, Alhamdulillah, like I said, I managed to get out of that mindset, terrible mindset of mine, with not only myself, okay, with the help of so many people getting back my motivation, you know, looking at color palettes, just, just, um, just to get myself going, you know, um, this is what I love doing, right? So I tend to inspire myself with doing the things that I love by finding, finding back, going back to the reason why I like doing what I like. Get me? I find bad inspirations, I try drawing again, um, I sketch my outfits and all, I kemas bili, I, you know it's really crazy, I kemas bili, like see I bought that, that's new, right, that was just in this year I think, or last year, so that's how I tend to get myself inspired back again, because I know it's really hard for me to be inspired, so macam in a sense, saya tengah pujuk diri sendiri and I know like people are gonna say oh ni sebab tak baiki relationship with God and all and actually no I know my relationship with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala insyaAllah it's just between me and him it's a secret between me and also my creator and it's a good relationship insyaAllah but it's just what's in my heart I just don't feel that as a tenang doing what I'm doing because I feel like it's a sign from God that it is not for me that's all paham tak? and also what I'm trying to say is that cuba cari kebekatan from what you're doing by doing it with ikhlas for me the the lesson that I received from the bad phrase of my life was that if you want to do anything buat dengan ikhlas that's the only way that you're going to do it betul-betul you know get me? If you want to do something, do it in your class so that you're going to be happy at the end of the day 
um, insya Allah things are gonna get easier and Allah akan permudahkan and although it is gonna be hard at the end of the day like my what my one of my favorite lectures said like, you're gonna smile at the end of the day so I just think about that lah I'm gonna take the Brina Beauty as you guys can see I tried playing with this already especially this shade because I really like how highlighted it is so I'm gonna prime my eyes first to prime my eyes I make the same shade that I use on my face which is this number 03 natural beige this is what the tubes look like okay Okay, I think before we play with the eyeshadow, we're going to put on the eyebrow first. So I'm going to be right back and then I'm going to show you how I feel with the steamy brow plus. Okay. I really like how Benefit your products can. They're all like, I don't know, I like it. So the one looks like this. It's so small. Hopefully it gets to fill these gaps. Oh, I like that. Ooh, I really like this. I don't think this is what my skin looks like up close and personal. On top of that smart drawing thing, what do you guys think? Are you guys liking this? Because I like this. I like this finish. Okay, so do we see what we have here on this side? I feel like it looks nice. I like it how it looks. So, the 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 pants with some personal personal skin. Like I said, we're gonna take this shade called Rusty and also Suntan. This shade right here, this one and this one, and then focus it on the outer crease. to finish off what I cerita kat you guys tadi kan it's really important for you to find good support system and even if you tak ada support system can rely on yourself because at the end of the day you only got yourself and it also taught us how to berdikari but yeah do you guys see how pigmented that is <coughs> love it Taking a clean brush, we're just going to clean the edges up using circular motions so that there won't be any harsh transition. Then we're going to take the shade called Teacup, which is this nice, this very, very neutral transition shade right here. Take a bit, shade Teacup, and then. And then we are going to take. The shade called Memory. Memory is this one. This is the shade Memory. I like how the shade names are there. So much I'm so you know. So we're gonna take this matte cream shade at the top of your eyes, like so. I'm taking the shade Diary. Diary, and we're putting it on the center of the eyelid. At your tear duct area, we're taking the shade called Enchanted. This is like my favorite shade out of this palette. And then we're just going to lay that here. And then on the center of the eyelid, just to pop it up a bit more, I'm taking the shade called Gleam. And I'm putting it on the center of the eyelid. Just patting it ever so slightly. So, we're gonna put on an eyeliner. And I'm gonna be will skip us out this mascara. And we're gonna put on our lips. And inshallah, we should be done. Done with the eyeliner. By the way, I wore this Voye 
waterproof liquid liner from Hourglass. This is currently my favorite eyeliner at the moment. And now we're taking the Maybelline New York Hyper Curl Volume Express Easy Wash Mascara. This one's super senang basuh. Dia macam you tak payah guna banyak effort ya yeah? untuk basuh. This thing is macam senang. I suka macam kalau nak solat ke apa ke. Okay, so we are done with the face and also with the eyes. How are you guys feeling? You know, I'm so sorry. This is not my best look, but I tried. For the lips, we have these shades right here, which I really like. I'm just going to wear this new, new, new lipstick. I don't know why do I like those kind of colors. But I think for today's look, I'm going to wear the shade Spice Latte, which is this one, this one right here. And if you guys want to see those swatches of this lipstick, it's on my Instagram, which I'll also link down below. Mm. It smells like, do you guys remember the NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream again? It smells like that. It's good. Okay, so my verdict on this product is that I suka uh, I suka sangat, I really like this product I feel like it's really really good on my skin and it doesn't break me out which is great and um, some products if I wear it it'll, it's gonna like emphasize on um, my acne scars and all but then this doesn't do that which is great and I really like the shapes of the blusher and also but I Ah, and also the color corrector but the only problem that I have here is with the contouring shade which I feel like they could do it a bit more warmer and also a bit more um, darker that is and as for the Brina Beauty Wanderlust eyeshadow right here I feel like it's such a good eyeshadow palette because as you can see the shades here they bukan macam this monotonous browns I feel like these shades are really really great they have array of darker shades, transition, a pop of color here and there and I feel like this is such a very great palette. However, I feel like their lipsticks are a bit drying. I feel like my suggestion is if you guys want to try their liquid lipsticks, do put a lip mask or a hydrating lip balm underneath it before you put on the liquid lipstick. That is all. And for this easy walk, Hyper Curl Volume Express Mascara, yes, it is really really easy to wash it. And lastly, from the Gimme Brow Plus from Benefit, it's really nice and it tones down uh, my eyebrow shade and it makes it lighter. Do but lagi macam sesuai sikit with my eyebrow pencil that I use, Goof proof brow pencil. So I feel like those are really great. And I feel like that is it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, do sound it off below. Do come back and subscribe to my channel. If you guys want, and then like, comment, share it, do whatever you want with it. And thank you so much for watching again. I hope you guys have a very nice day. And assalamualaikum. Bye. 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 <laughs> thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye. This 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 red color. Red color. Bye. Bye. Say, Say mwah. Say mwah. Bye. I love you. I love you. Wake up. Bye, guys.